Hello everyone, welcome to Dog TV Uganda, older show for the dog lovers. And I'm your host, Namjere Sandra. Today's episode, we are at Mr. Henry, the dog breeder. to that show. Please introduce yourself to our beautiful viewers and tell us more. Hello uh, viewers, I'm called Henry Jabo. I am uh, a breeder of uh, South African boar bulls. But um, before that, uh, professionally, I'm an advocate of the High Court and um, I work in a bank as uh, a company secretary. Wow, that's so cool and interesting. I've seen Dublin. It's a beautiful dog, and it's a uh, it's a male. So, Mister Mister Henry, tell us more about Dublin. Yeah, Dublin was born in uh, in South Africa um, in April 2020. Um, he came to Uganda in November because he was uh, being boarded one, by one of our friends in South Africa. Yeah. So we bought Dublin because of his bloodline. He's from what we, we call in the Bourbon world the Aventure bloodline. One of those old bloodlines that had been diminishing and now we are trying to revive it here. So it's the major foundation of this kennel. Yeah. We want to breed around the Aventure bloodline. Yeah. It comes with the, the rich coat, the dark or deep red color, what some would call uh, coffee brown and stuff like that. Then um, you've seen the dark markings on his chest and, and the tiny white spot, the dark mask. So those, those are the aspects that we are looking out for. And also Dublin has proved himself to be a very fertile dog, a uh, very good producer. Uh, recently he gave us uh, 15 puppies in, um, in one liter. It's not our record because we've had a dog giving us 17 puppies. Mm -hmm. But surprisingly, all the 15 puppies have made it to the two-week mark alive. And uh, yeah, so that's Dublin for you. So Mr. Henry, recently you were at a show of CAU, a dog show, and your dog did a great job. I really loved it. It was so beautiful. And it won itself a trophy. Yeah. So tell us more how someone out there, a dog breeder, who would wish to win a dog show and how to train a dog to, to be obedient to you? Um, yeah. We, our, our boy, Majingilani Dublin, was, um, he got two awards. One was the best in show award, meaning that overall he was the best dog that turned up for the show and best of breed, which means that he was the best burbul at the show. Uh, we were happy for that award. But uh, a show dog must have certain characteristics. One, its appearance. Two, its movement. Three, also the handler plays a role. Because if, if there is no chemistry between the dog and um, and the handler, then it will not turn up, it will not move well, it will not do what uh, the judge is looking out for, the, the characteristics that the judge is looking out for. So I advise people to give their dogs time, um, maybe go to YouTube or the internet and look up uh, some of these um, training materials on how to prepare your dog for the show. So uh, part of the preparation is in uh, the food you give the dog. Yeah, because for me, I know my dogs, if they're well fed, they'll have a shiny coat, which, um, which, which will, will also be one of the aspects that will, will give it an edge of a dog that, is not, um, that has not turned up in, in a good uh, condition. Two, do your small run, run arounds according to what you've seen on those uh, training materials. 
then also practice uh, the art of stacking. Stacking is how you cause the dog to stand so that it can display its best characteristics. Best male goes to the Dublin. Second one is our, our young male Rufus. And then there are two more males. Thank you very much. Mr. Henry, tell us more about Canine Association Uganda. Um, Canine Association is a registry. That's its, its, um, its main objective. It's a registry of purebred dogs in Uganda. Why it was established was to take Uganda into the realm of um, FCI membership. FCI is the international, the biggest international body that um, approves dog breeds. So it, 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 it um, approves an entity, say like Canine Association of Uganda, to be a dog registry with um, recognition from FCI. Now, um, to gain FCI membership is not easy. It takes a lot of work, and that is why you see canine associations started with this breed assessment, because we want to register all the pure breeds in Uganda. Mm -hmm. Then, um, two, you have to invite FCI accredited judges. They are what they call breed-specific judges, and then all breed judges. Yes, so Canine Association of Uganda is almost akin to East African Kennel Club. Only that for us, we want to take it international. We want to be recognized by any other uh, body in the world. So that if you breed your dog in Uganda, its pedigree can be registered in another country. Rather than breeding locally, and then you can only sell your dogs locally and register your dogs locally. Because without, without um, the agenda that CAU is pushing, all the dogs that we breed here, whether they are imported from Europe or South Africa, wherever, they will end up becoming local or locally bred dogs with local recognition. Mm. But we want international recognition of the dogs that are bred in Uganda. Yeah. Yes, so Canine Association of Uganda is going to be organizing shows like the one that just concluded. It's going to be organizing trainings for breeders. It's going to be giving guidance on best practice, how to breed, what to breed, um, and all things related to dogs. My beautiful viewers, Mr. Henry is going to explain to us the good job Dublin did. Uh, so when you look here, um, you'll see a certificate of best of breed. And it's presented to Dublin. The breed is for Burbul. So, in other words, at the just concluded show, the National Dog Show of 2021, Dublin was rated the best burbul. Yeah, so he got that certificate and this, um, this thing is called a rosette. I don't know why they gave it such a name, but yeah, so it says best of breed. Yeah, this is very important when someone wants to have a, a show career, mm -hmm. having such accolades is important. It's now, this one is the best in show certificate, meaning that I have the bragging rights now of having the best dog in Uganda. Yes, rate, as rated by an FCI all breed judge. Yeah, so this is an important thing. Um, and this is the trophy that we had. It's uh, straight from Russia. Yeah, we are the first, the winner the first best in show winner and um, canine association of uganda so this rosette was given to us um, for the best in show award yeah so it comes together with the trophy Henry, how big is your kennel here we currently have um, nine dogs we have six breeding burbles one puppy and uh, two beagles but it's expanding, yeah. Expanding to a big one. Yes, we want to work with about 20 dogs. We are going to import um, golden retrievers and uh, maybe 
one or two dogs just for sure, not for breeding, but for sure, because we shall bring just one of that breed. Yeah, because we want, to, we want this kennel to be known as a, a kennel that shows its dogs and wins uh, championships. Yeah. So in case anyone wants to reach you to buy a dog or any breed, how do they reach you? Um, we are on Facebook as uh, Burbuls of Uganda. Then um, you can call us on our numbers 774-089800 or 772-905-182. Uh, and then uh, we discuss the way forward. <laughs> Thanks for watching my beautiful viewers, but don't forget to subscribe, to like and keep on sharing. For more interesting stories, don't forget the notification bell.